Introducing DrivePilot, an automated driving system available on your new S-Class or EQS sedan. Mercedes-Benz has introduced this feature to give you back time in a freeway traffic jam. We're excited to show you how DrivePilot creates a paradigm shift in the driving experience and inform you about the important role you play behind the wheel. Your vehicle is equipped with both Active Distance Assist Distronic as well as Active Steering Assist features that provide cooperative driving assistance. When using these systems, you remain responsible for the entire driving task. This means you must keep your hands on the wheel and eyes on the road at all times. In contrast, Drive Pilot, under a specific set of conditions, will take over the dynamic driving task. You are not driving when the system is active, even though you must remain in the driver's seat. When Drive Pilot is active, you become the fallback ready user which allows you to remove your hands from the steering wheel, take your eyes off the road, and turn your attention to other activities inside the vehicle. However, when DrivePilot requests, you must take over the driving task from DrivePilot. Please note that DrivePilot will only operate up to 40 miles per hour in traffic jams on a pre-mapped freeway network approved by Mercedes-Benz. Your Mercedes-Benz is equipped with LiDAR, camera, radar and ultrasonic sensors that work together to accurately detect the driving environment around you. DrivePilot also uses regularly updated information from high-definition maps, which provide accurate road geometry information miles ahead of the vehicle and beyond the eyesight of a driver. To use DrivePilot, First, ensure the headlight and windshield wiper switch settings are set to auto mode. Once you are driving on a pre-mapped freeway section and all necessary conditions are satisfied, DrivePilot will show it is available, indicated by both an icon in the instrument cluster, as well as by a white light glowing in the steering wheel buttons. To activate DrivePilot, press either one of the steering wheel buttons. The system will prepare to transition control from you by adapting the following distance to the vehicle in front, and centering your vehicle in the lane. Drive Pilot is active once the status indicator lights on the side of the steering wheel and on top of the steering column are solid turquoise. Once you have read the message in the instrument cluster, please acknowledge your understanding by pressing OK on the left button panel on the steering wheel. Now you can take your eyes off the road and turn your attention to other activities, providing useful time for in-car entertainment features if you wish. Please be aware that state and local laws may prohibit the fallback ready user from using a handheld mobile device. Please also be aware that no object should ever be placed between you and an airbag. You will notice the turquoise status indicator lights remain solid at all times the drive pilot system is active. The set speed and following distance are set by drive pilot and cannot be manually adjusted by you, the fallback ready user. DrivePilot automatically keeps a suitable distance from surrounding vehicles. The system can handle obstacles on the road, even stopped vehicles. If sufficient space is available, your Mercedes-Benz will drive around them within its own lane. DrivePilot will not exit the current lane, and therefore you may need to disengage the system to follow your planned route. When the conditions for DrivePilot are no longer satisfied, the system will alert you with a takeover request. A takeover request is indicated visually by the red illumination of the status indicator lights, a message in the instrument cluster, as well as an audible alert. Put your hands on the steering wheel and keep your eyes on the road. Steer, brake or accelerate as necessary and ensure the safe operation of the vehicle and compliance with traffic regulations. As the fallback ready user of this system, it is your responsibility to take control of the vehicle as soon as DrivePilot issues a takeover request informing you to do so. Conditions may arise at any time that require you, the fallback ready user, to respond to a takeover request. If a fallback ready user does not respond to the takeover request within the maximum allotted time of 10 seconds, for example due to a medical crisis, the vehicle's emergency stop procedure will begin. Your Mercedes-Benz will begin to brake and then come to a full stop in its current lane. Surrounding traffic is warned by the activation of your hazard lights. Once the vehicle is at standstill, the parking brake is engaged. 
the Mercedes-Benz emergency call system is activated and the vehicle doors are unlocked to enable emergency personnel access. You, the fallback ready user, can always disengage the system by pressing one of the drive pilot buttons or by steering, for example, to manually change lanes. At all times, the vehicle can be stopped by depressing the brake pedal and a takeover request will be issued if the gas pedal is pressed. To operate safely, Drive Pilot requires certain conditions to be satisfied. A list of these conditions is included in the operator's manual. Examples of conditions that will trigger a takeover request include, but are not limited to, construction zones, inclement weather, unsuitable lighting conditions, or if the vehicle enters an area with non-existent or poor satellite reception or lane markings. Drive Pilot is not available under certain traffic scenarios, such as when the system detects a pedestrian on the freeway, or when there is no longer a nearby leading vehicle in the same lane. Additionally, the system is not available when sirens or flashing lights from an emergency vehicle are detected by the vehicle's camera and microphone system. If Drive Pilot is already active, a takeover request will be issued. When upcoming route information indicates that the suitability of the freeway will end soon, Drive Pilot will provide you with notice of the upcoming takeover request through the yellow illumination of the status indicator lights and will display an approximate remaining distance in the instrument cluster. As the fallback ready user, you must be prepared to respond to a takeover request. This requires you, the fallback ready user, to be unimpaired, well rested and alert. Drive Pilot uses multiple sensors in the cabin to monitor that the fallback ready user is positioned to take control of the vehicle at all times. Always keep the seat belts fastened and maintain a proper seating position. The steering wheel, and pedals in particular, must be within easy reach of the individual in the driver's seat. At all times, ensure a clear view of the surrounding traffic situation, using the windshield wipers and the defrost function to assist if necessary. It is important that the vehicle is well maintained and consistently kept in suitable condition for roadway travel, which includes keeping the exterior clean and free from dirt and debris. See the operator's manual for further information. With Drive Pilot, Mercedes-Benz offers you unprecedented technology and takes the next step towards autonomous driving, giving you back the greatest luxury of all, time.